Hello Mayors, and welcome back to Build It With Smith. I'm your host Smith, and in this video, I am going to be giving you some tips on how you can upgrade faster. Now if you don't already know, upgrades are the key to success if you want to level up in the game. When a building is ready to upgrade, this hard hat will appear. Click the hard hat and you will be shown the combination of items that you will need in order to make the upgrade happen. The items are going to come from your commercial buildings. These buildings use the raw materials from your factories to craft a particular item. Okay, tip number one is to keep some available space in your city storage. I only have 180 slots and most of these are filled with particular items that I don't seem to be getting prompted for at the time. So, it's a good practice to clear these out every once in a while. Plus, you can earn money by selling them at the Trade HQ. I pretty much clear out everything except for my expansion items. Tip number two is to keep your factory stock full of raw materials that takes more than two hours to craft. This will increase your productivity and efficiency. For instance, you can only unlock a maximum of 10 factories, so you should choose wisely on how they're being used when you're offline. It doesn't make any sense for me to produce metal, wood, or plastic while I'm not in the game because these items only take under 10 minutes to produce. But it is a good idea to keep things like seeds, minerals, chemicals, and textiles in constant production throughout the day. If you're the type of player who logs in and out while at work or school, it's a good practice to put these items into production before you log out. This way, when you log back in, you're not having to wait 20, 30, and maybe even 3 hours because you don't have these essential items that the game uses a lot. Tip number 3. Produce long lead items that take over 3 hours overnight. Things like animal feed, electrical components, and glass can kill your productivity if you don't have them. I usually make about 5 to 10 each uh, because most recipes don't call for these items a lot. Now a bonus tip has to do with the fact that depending on your experience level in the game your trade HQ may advertise a lot of a certain item. So I wouldn't waste any factory slots on something that is readily available at the trade HQ. For me I tend to find a lot of glass and sugars easily. Tip number four is to go ahead and make the essential items that recipes usually call for. For instance, nails, hammers, shovels, and planks are all usually part of other recipes, like tables use planks, nails, and hammers. It really cuts down on productivity by having these items readily available in my city storage. From time to time, you'll find these items floating around in the trade HQ. Go ahead and grab them and save even more time. Now the last and final tip, tip number five, is to upgrade your commercial buildings when prompted to. This speeds up the production time. See how some of mine have three stars? I'm really kicking butt. But anyway, I hope some of these tips were helpful. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more SimCity Build It and SimCity PC videos. Also head over to my Facebook page for live streams. Thanks for watching.